In July 2017, a Kavok Air of aircraft performing a flight from Sao Tome to Accra in Ghana ingested a number of birds, prompting the crew to reject takeoff. The aircraft overran the end of the runway and was substantially damaged beyond repair. On the invitation of the Sao Tome government, the Accident Investigation Bureau of Nigeria investigated the accident. Para fazermos a foto, família, nosso tradicional foto. Seventeen months after, the report is ready and officials from Nigeria are in that country to present the document. The boss of the accident agency in Nigeria reads out one of the nine safety recommendations. They should improve the habitat management program, including reduction or elimination of trees, shrubs, and other plants which provide food, shelter, or roasting sites. For then the report is handed over. As the first uh, corporation regarding investigation uh, out of uh, Nigeria. That's why we're very proud to, to be the first country with Nigeria perform the investigation for. With the International Air Transport Association praising Africa's records of no jet or losses for two years and no fatalities on any aircraft in Africa, the Minister of Infrastructure and Environment of South Tome says the recommendations will be implemented. This is the easy, easiest uh, part of uh, the problem. Um, uh, of course, uh, we will. We will do our best to improve all, all this, uh, this situation. To further the relationship between both parties in the area of accident investigation, they put pen to paper. With an MOU in place between Nigeria and Sao Tome, experts say this is a plus for aviation cooperation and capacity development, as most countries in Africa commit to raising the safety bar. From the Nigerian Embassy in Sao Tome and Principe, Bukola Joe Oketumbi, Channels Television News.